All right, everybody, this is awesome news. We're actually sitting out front the U.S. disciplinary barracks here in Leavenworth, and uh, Clint, Rale Clint, Clint Lawrence, First Lieutenant Clint Lawrence, will be coming out momentarily. He's going to be transferred to a van. We're going to be moving out to the front gate, and then we're going to be reuniting him with his family. I'm actually here with John Marr. John Marr was the lead attorney, the one who took this case, has been fighting this case for years now, six years. So, John, have you got anything you want to say to everybody I out just, there? I'd like to say thank the President of the United States, the Vice President. I'd like to say thank Pete Hegseth. I'd like to thank uh, the United American Patriots. I'd like to thank Suzanne White. I'd like to thank Congressman Graves and the entire Louisiana Coalition. And I'd like to thank Green Beret Sontai Raider Terry Buckler. All right, hold on a second. Let's say hi to that warrior. Hey, guys. There we go. Great day tonight. Absolutely. Yes. Silver Star recipient right here, Vietnam vet. And let's go back, John. You got anything else you want to say? No, because here they come. All right. We're going to be standing. Clint reuniting with his family. Uh, this is absolutely exciting news. And uh, thank you to all the congressmen that came by and support. Thank you for the Justice for Warriors Caucus. And thank you to you. It, none, none of this would have happened if it were not for all the support, the prayers, the shares, the donations, everything that you've done to get behind this and UAP to make sure that uh, we saw this warrior see justice. So this is a, a really exciting night for everyone. Stand by, we're gonna be giving you more information and we're gonna be coming alive soon. So hang in there.